Okay, hello everyone. Welcome back to our new lesson that talking about the lesson five, swimming fish in a spray lab. Okay, so I review to all of you a little bit about our course. In the sequence, we have four lessons. Okay, finish with the lesson four, creating art with the code in the last video. Okay, so now we go to the spray. We call it spray. So in the spray, we have two more lessons, lesson five and lesson six. Okay, lesson five is talking about swimming fish in the spray lab. So you will be wonder that what is spray, right? Okay, what is spray? Okay, so in this video, in the puzzle one, you can click here to watch this video that guide you or introduce you about the spray. What is a spray? Okay. In this video, I'm um, talk a little bit. Okay, sprite is a character, a character or an object that you can be interact with. Okay, for example, like this tiger. Okay, and has many more. Okay, like that. That's all we call the sprite. Okay, what can we do with the sprite? We can move it. Okay, move it from left to right, right to left, up to button, a button to top. Okay. Okay, so it has many sprites in the sprite lab. Okay, it has object like this apple. Okay, or we can be interact with it and we can create the dance party. Okay, so many more you can do it with the sprite to make your game or your app more beautiful. Okay, so so you can explore it in the next puzzle together okay so i hope you understand this sprite okay that's all is sprite it is a character or an object okay so we move to the this puzzle okay that's called prediction in the instruction here it said like that look closely at the code below what will happen after you click run okay after you click run what will be happen okay what will be happen okay so this is the new code new block of code that you never see before okay so you just um predict it. okay just predict it okay let's say the answer a it say nothing will happen Answer B. Answer B. The thumb of it will float to the top of the screen. Okay. C. Tumble. The tumble width will begin tumbling. Okay. The tumble width will bling on and up. So, what is the right answer of this code? If we don't know the code, we never studied before or don't know what it will be it can do okay so just predict it so let's take a look at this code it say make new i think this is a sprite okay the tumble width okay sprite at 399 okay you will be wonder what is 300 and what is 99 okay what is that okay you think it okay but we can see that it's make it in 300 it will be the x okay you can see here when you move your mouse okay your cursor around there you can see this 300 x and you move up there to the 99 you will see the position of the over tumble width okay so the tumble width location will be made here. After make the sprite or tumble width, the sprite, this sprite or tumble width begin tumbling. Okay. So you can see the tumbling. Okay. You just uh, see the answer C. The tumble width will be tumbling. Okay. You just click it. Okay. And run it and check does it right or not. Okay. Okay. Wait and see. 
Okay, it is not so the answer. We choose right or wrong. Okay, here. But I think it will be tumbling. Okay, tumbling from the right to the left. Okay, you can see here. Okay. Okay, let's go. Okay. So this just um, a prediction. So we go to the next puzzle, skill building. Okay. So Okay, this icon means that this level is part of the larger project. Chang will be saved across similar this level. Okay, so I break it down and see what it want to tell us. Okay, so let's make a fish tank. Okay, fish tank. Chang the tumble bit sprite into any tank of fish by clicking. Okay, clicking this this um, code okay to choose any fish we should also update this price consume okay update this price costume in sprite begin okay it means that we change the sprite to do any fish that you want okay i choose uh this fish okay after that it wants us to change the costume in a sprite. Okay, you can change in a sprite in a costume too. Uh, I want to notify you that if you choose to make sprite is the this face, but in a sprite begin or in a sprite costume, you did not change the face is nothing. Okay, it's not move anything. Okay, so you need to change this to that fish too. Okay, so that make the fish to be a uh, spinning, spinning right. Okay, you can see here. So if you choose another fish that different from the the old one, okay, different from the make the new fish. So you run it, it nothing happen. So your fish, be sure that it is same, right? Okay, here and this spinning right is mean that when you make the fish and then to make your fish spinning okay it's begin to spinning this code we call it just like a spray costume okay and one more thing about that if you want that fish to change its location x and y so how could you do okay so this one is 300 it it represent to the x okay you can see here x and 100 it represent to the y so the zero of the x and y is here it the uh, button left of our play area it is zero x and zero y here you can see here and this one we can see the x will be 400 and y will be 400 at the top right of our play area here okay you can see here so if you want to move your fish to another to to any anywhere in the play area you just set it position x and y great okay so it is easy way you can click in this this icon you can click it after you click it you can drag and drop your fish okay move your mouse and just click and then your fish will be there okay like example here okay click it and the fish will be there and i run it the fish will be spinning there okay that is our new our new code make fish where is your fish want to be where is your fish location okay so this one for the first parameter we call it x and second is y and this sprite to make your your your, your sprite or your fish to be do something like spinning or rotation or swimming okay next we will see the swimming okay so this one will be finished and we go to the next puzzle in puzzle four okay so okay this call use the block to leave your cell or 
your teacher notes about how your code works. Okay, I will uh, guide you about this comment. Okay, so everyone see that the fish is getting dizzy. Okay, dizzy. Change the fish behavior so that it can swim left and right. Okay, your fish will be dizzy like that. Okay, mm -hmm. it will be dizzy. It rotation, rotation, and then it will be dizzy. So we want us to okay it's want us to change its behavior to swim because fish swim can swim so let let it swim it swim okay so when run its fish fly at like that like we said before so we can change the location to there okay and then spray and then spinning right so i drag off the spinning okay so i drop the new code block of code called swimming left and right okay so that will be changed the behavior of our fish to be swim okay like that swimming right and it will da -da -da. when it right the, the the x or, or x 400 it will be back to x zero it arrive zero it will be back to t four Hundred. Okay, it will be go forward and go back, go forward and go back like that. Okay, so this is we use the new block of code called swimming left and right. Okay, to the our new sprite. Okay, so I want to introduce you about the comment block. What does comment block do? Okay, the comment block is uh just a block that you can write something. Okay, call that make face swim okay you can see like that after you run you see that the make fish run is nothing here it's not showing anything so it means that the command is just the the note for your code to make you remember that what does the code below does okay so you can also has many common in the code okay to make sure that you you to make sure that the code will be clear and when someone look check your code they will be understand about your code okay this one is make the face and the x um 63 and a bridge nine one hundred and eighty five okay so this just command to tell that the make the fish at the location at the location okay we can call the location okay this location and make new sprite at there and after that make the fish spin okay that's all we run nothing um different from the old one okay you notice <laughs> that the command it does not affect or run when the code is run, common all the common is ignore for running. Okay. Okay, that's all. We go to the next level. Okay, our fish tank need some water. Okay, you see that the fish is no water. It is swim in the air. Okay, that can be cannot cannot be that. So we use the another block of code called the set background color and to make the background any color but very common blue. So you just drag and drop this background color at the button or at the top. Okay, like that. So you can change any color that you like. Okay, but every common is blue. So blue is represent to the water or the sea or the ocean, right? Like that. So we can check any color that you want. Okay. It's like that. It is C or show this color. Okay. Okay. So that's all for this puzzle. Go to the next. Okay. In this uh, puzzle, we have a video that we can make the sprite. And if you don't know how to make the sprite, you can watch this video. Okay. So I think it's not. For us right now, but if you want, you can watch at the 
puzzle to okay how to make a sprite. So in the another levels, okay, so we can see it's two box. You can see the two box. It has the another word we can call the world sprite and behavior. It is the new thing that you can see in this level. So read the instruction first. The first is the adventures adventurous okay and want to meet new creature okay in the sea add another sprite to the fish tank this sprite can have any costume other than the one you use for your fish okay so if you run this code you see that our fish um arrive there and stop okay so what we we have to do we want we need to do is that add another sprite okay any sprite that you want okay so i just drag and drop out this comment i think it's make you uh this call to see that so i just drag and drop this you see that okay this is the one sprite what we want to do is to add another sprite so how could we add that so we go to the world we can see the set background and set background color. This is the new thing. Okay, so I do not use the set background color. I use the new one. We call it set background. Okay, you look like uh, like the real the real the real ocean or the real fish in the water. Okay, you can see that. You can choose here. Okay okay i choose this one so this wall we have two block of code that remain the set background color and set background too that is an image okay the image not the not the color so we go to the sprite if you want to make a new sprite so we drag and drop to make the new sprite i want a another another sprite call it i call it turtle okay make a turtle the turtle i think is not right here it should be at the button okay button okay right there after that you go to the sprite again to set the size if you want your turtle bigger or smaller you can you set the size and choose the turtle that you want and choose the size okay size for speed okay now i just um, change the sprite another one is you can test it by your own okay i change it to just like 50 okay it's a size bit smaller smaller you want to be this one big okay this big okay let's move it to make your the tall is big okay oh the tall is bigger than fish okay it want to eat fish okay <laughs> okay go to the sprite again okay nothing here anymore inside the sprite has two blocks make new sprite and set size or set the rotation or set x or set y or move direction here okay so no i'm um, drag and drop it off okay so we go go through to the behavior inside the behavior we have the behavior of our sprite what do you want your sprite do okay so first i want the turtle to swim to swim left and swim right the same are the fish okay so let's run it you can see okay now our fish and turtle are swimming or walking in the sea or the ocean here so if you want to make your fish bigger or smaller you also can set the size to your fish like that okay set the fish size to 152 okay so you can see this fish is bigger okay so we'll drag and drop over turtle again okay that's cool okay and if you want to change your sprite behavior you can go to the behavior and use another spin okay so you drag and drop it off 
going to spin. Okay, you have to throw the spin. You have to throw the DZ right now. Okay. So that's all. I think this is that's all in this puzzle. Okay. And this is just introduced to the world. That's told about the environment of our sprite, like the background color or background image. And sprite, you can make sprite and set the size of the sprite and behavior. We can set the behavior of the sprite. One, one the sprite do anything that you want. Okay, spin or swim. Next, we have another block of code about the it behavior. Okay. So we move to the next level. Okay, it's like a bit slow, right? Just wait it a bit. Okay. Okay, it's work. Okay, read the instruction. What do you want your face new friend to do? Add a behavior and watch them go. Okay, this it just simple. It just want us to change the the new sprite that we just added turtle to the new behavior. So I think inside the behavior it has many many uh, behavior. Okay, it has turtling, it has spinning right, spinning left right, and rendering. Okay, so we just try to the new one is turtling. What does it do? Okay, our new sprite is not swimming or walking, it does bigger, small, big, small, big, small. Okay, so we try to another one, it's called rendering. Okay, oh, the turtle is now, is moving. Okay, it, it, I think it can go up here. Yeah. Okay, it can pop up. Okay, that's good. It like the real. The real control and the real speech. Okay, I, I think it it's like good. Okay, good. Okay, that's awesome for this behavior. Okay, like the real. It's not go straight. It can up and down, up and down. Okay, that's all we can see here in the world. It's same sprite, the same, but in the behavior, it add two more behavior. It's the ring and when the ring. Okay. So go to the next puzzle. Okay. We add a lot of new block to toolbox. Okay, it adds more about the location you can see here. First we have world sprite and behavior. Another we have location. Play with them to make your face tank special. Okay, it is free play what you want. You can make it left, right, or anything that you want. Okay, now I can see here location. Okay, inside there we can set the location you want. Okay, after that you can set the random location also. So I try another one is called the random. Okay, so if we drag the random, the random block here, the overfish and over total location, we don't know. We don't know where it starts, so run. Okay, so after we run, you can see the fish and the turtle is a random location X and Y. So we don't know where is the it should be there. Okay, where is the location? Okay, so this is the function of the random location. Okay, if you want a specific location, you can use the location the same as before and Drag and drop this. You can make a freeze up there, and you can um, set the turtle down there. Okay, click it first, and then down there. Okay. Okay. So the difference between the random and the specific is random. We don't know the is location when it start, and uh, if you want to clear the location or more specific, you can set the x and y as you want. Okay, now check the world. It has many, many things here. It is so title screen, title, subtitle. Okay, the, it is high title screen, play sound. So it has more three block of code that you can do. 
Okay, first try the this one. Okay, I can set it here. It'd be I I said I said it fish tank. Okay, fish tank. So you can see here the old or the the title is show up here. Okay. So it is a subtitle. I say it free play. So it's so down there. It is the subtitle. Okay. So another one we can say it like um high title screen. What does it do? Okay. When you drag it down there, the title on the screen will be high. Okay. Or hidden from from the over play area okay so drag it out you can see the the title here another one is play sound okay we want to play sound right there okay I just choose okay when you click it you can choose any sound that you want okay you can call it like um, the, 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 I can call it the uh, instrument song. Okay, I just play it and choose. I think it's better. So after that, you can see here the sound we want to play. After run it, okay, it just play one time. Ding. Okay, like that. Okay, after it's run, I think it should be hidden title on screen. Okay, mm -hmm. that's all about it. So go to the sprite okay we have another block of code too that's called change color up okay if you want to change your sprite color you can do it too okay go to it and set it okay i want to change the fish to be another color okay i set it to be black okay let's see you can see the fish is black right now okay or you can set it like um, green. Okay, that looks more look more beautiful, right? And choose it. Reset. Okay. This one red. Okay, yeah, red fish. Okay. Okay. That just free play that you can play it by your own side here. Okay. So location already behavior okay inside the behavior it's add a lot of more behavior that you can um test it okay you can see here's move s move north move south move west okay patrolling drinking or spinning right swimming or rendering as before okay you can play with it also so i just play with it a little bit okay oh you can click edit it Edit it. Okay. So oh, no, just close it. I think it's we have just like growing. And then another one is like a move S. Okay, it's move to the S. You can see here. Okay, your face is um growing. It's mean that it has a bigger and bigger. Okay, that's all for this puzzle. Okay, you can play it inside the behavior here. So I think I should go to the lesson extra. Okay, the lesson extra of lesson five is none. So it, it doesn't pass. It doesn't have any any more. So we go through to the next lesson is lesson six and the next video. So all of you guys don't forget to subscribe my channel and click like and share to your friend and hit the bell button for the new video that i upload okay so goodbye see you in the next video